Brissett throws, connects with Njoku. It looks like he came back about a yard shy of the first down. Former Ohio State quarterback Justin Fields in his second year. Out of the shotgun, hands it off to David Montgomery, and he is lassoed and has nowhere to go. Well, there's only about eight or nine Browns, so take your pick. Taven Bryan in the middle of it all, the newcomer from Jacksonville. Three and out, first time around. Johnson stopped after a three-yard gain. Once again, it is cut-down day on Tuesday. The greater things in life. Jacoby Brissett, another drive. Throws it downfield, connects with Njoku, gets it up to the 44. Might have been his best throw of the evening, right there. Khalil Herbert, and he gets dropped. Nice hit there by Sean Jolly. This would give the crowd a little something to cheer about. From 57, York has plenty of leg, and it is good. Brown's defense trying to force a mistake of Simeon. Trying to show a late disguise there by the Browns. Oh, yeah, defense. and they wrap him up. Is the ball on the turf? It is. And the Browns have recovered. Perrion Winfrey, the fourth round pick out of Oklahoma, gobbles it up. And Cleveland is back in business. Defensive line to come around the edge there. Sean Jolly, first one to make contact there. Great job by the Browns defense swarming, and our guy Perry on Winfrey. So York from 46, and he nails it again. Dude's got leg. Man, that should have just been an email. Could you just email <laughs> me if you really had nothing for me? You know, you know what? You usually, uh, usually get those type of calls with uh, GMs that you used to work with. So. <laughs> What's that so Northwestern get, degree for I know, you? I know, but yeah. Acclimate. <laughs> Acclimate. There we go. Perfect. There we go. <laughs> Fred Newsom got that one perfectly. All right. Tell me, you just said you'd much rather be playing. What, what is this process like to watch your Fourth and goal. Browns fans excited, looking for their first touchdown of the night. Dobbs has it. There it is. Miller Forrestal. Just by his fingertips. And the Browns have their first touchdown of the night. Here it is, Miller Forrestal. He's down here. He's going to do a great job. The secondary, they're trying to exchange. It's Griffin Stewart setting up in the backfield. Dobbs pressured, keeps the play alive, hustles outside. Dobbs dives oh, and gets in there right. for the two-point conversion. Uh, you got to love this guy. The effort on this play to get that two-point conversion going up over the top. Stefanski loves it. As Dobbs with the pirouette, the dive, it's good for two. We, 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 all, we got a job to do. And uh, for us to be an elite team, an elite Super Bowl competitor, our defense has to play well, and we understand that. Okay, your defense has to play well, but Miles Garrett wants to play wide receiver. It's endearing, and it takes time to build, and you can just feel it within this Browns unit on defense, how much they love each other, how much they buy into what Joe Woods is doing. Well, that's a big deal. Another sack for the Browns. Curtis Weaver gets back there. Uh, let's see here. Oh, gosh. Yeah, You're no to fun. that guy. Rosen again throws it. Wims! That's just what I said. Go to Wims in the corner on the fade. Great job throwing it over the defensive back's head. I believed in him. I thought he could have got this feed in, in bounds there. Good play there by Sean Jolly. And there's a fumble! And the Browns have recovered at the 10 yard line. A great play by DeAnthony Bell and Sean Jolly. And it's Jordan Kanachik who comes up with it. And they force it really nicely to the edge. They extend it. The Browns do a great job punching the football out. That's and that's exactly what you need. Fires it. Harley, does he get in? And they oh, get they it, it to him. him. Yes. Run another quarterback sneak here. He does. There it is. Did he get in? Did he get in? He's definitely in. He's oh, in. Yeah. Confirmed. After the defense forced the turnover, it wasn't the prettiest sneak of all time. It wasn't Brady-esque, but it was good enough.